David, good morning. Well, you're actually finding me outside the Clifton Cultural Arts Center. We've been exploring all over the center all morning with John Leo. First of all, good morning. Thanks for being here. Good morning. Thanks for having me. Yeah. So let's talk about what's happening today. Yeah. So this is a, we're actually first time we're opening up our Cultural Arts Center to the whole community. So at 930, we're going to cut the ribbon, uh, a little bit of speeches just to commemorate the moment. And then from 10 to 2, we are going to have a jam-packed schedule of samplers, demos, performances, everything so people can kind of try out and get their, their toes wet in the water. And then at 2 o'clock, we're going to open the first gallery in this new space. So uh, you can come out and see Heritage. Awesome. That's yeah. super exciting stuff. So can you talk about the impact a center like this has on the community? Absolutely. So we are a kind of regional cultural arts center. We, I always like to say that we bring people together through the shared experience of art. So we're kind of really just a cultural center or a community center that wants to bring people together and we use the arts as a tool. So anyone, whether you're a novice or a professional painter, can come in and just experience new ways to express yourself. Yeah, and this has been a long time in the making, hasn't it? It has. So in 2018, we left the old Clifton School, which was our original home. We've been kind of traveling throughout the um, in church basements and other temporary spaces. And now we finally get to be in a real uh, space of our own that we built from scratch. I love it. And lastly, what would be your message to the community for coming out here either today or any time, really? Yeah, I think just... No matter what you think of the arts, come give us a try. I think we're, no matter where you're from, I know our name is Clifton Cultural Arts Center, but like I said, we're for everyone. Come try some stuff out and find out what, uh, what appeals to you. Awesome. Well, John Leo, thank you so much. Thanks for having us. Yeah. And one of the best parts is a lot of the programming here, David, is either free or it's low cost. Back to you. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you're always in the know.